not valid but at the same time i know they are valid but like i feel like for having those feelings I got it. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Bradley Barago Bazuri, African Muslim Media Platforms. If you're a channel subscriber, thank you for coming back. Today's a Tuesday. I'm going on a date, a cute little lunch date. So I'll take you guys with me to show you around. My Uber Alt is here. I think it's passing by. Let me go quickly. I'll catch up with you guys a bit later. But yeah, we're going to Jack's Bagel, which is a very nice, cute place where they sell bagels. So yeah, see you guys when I get there. <music> arrived i'm just waiting for shalom to get here i texted her so yeah just sitting outside just waiting for her a bit and then take you guys inside having a double vlog <laughs> vlog how are you doing i'm good Why are you <laughs> i'm black again <laughs> Green juice because I'm being healthy. <laughs> this guy, this is vlogging. <laughs> Someone else is vlogging but me, so it's not awkward. Like, this is nice. This is why you should be friends with YouTubers. Yeah, literally, yeah. literally. Miss Mama's in her skirt. I'm back home. I'm done. I'm just gonna go wash my face quickly because I'm not gonna sit here with this makeup. But oh my god, my eyebrows look perfect. Okay, if I do say so myself. But yeah, it was nice seeing Shalom today. I will link her YouTube channel down in the description box so you guys can go check out her YouTube channel. She's also a YouTuber, like your girl, me. <laughs> so yeah, that's it for the day. That was it. I'm just gonna go wash my face and I'm gonna chill because. I closed off my schedule for today so i have a day off finally so i can relax a bit i can catch up on some youtube videos and just try stuff i also took some cute 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 pictures so i'll just put them here on the side of the screen wait let me give myself space i'll just put them here on the side of the screen so you guys can see that restaurant eating place is the cutest thing ever it's very aesthetic so me and her both liked it we are doing a get and ready with me or remove my makeup with me. First of all, it's uh, my hair. But this is cute. This is really cute. This is really, really cute. But I just basically wash my face with my dust soap. I don't do that whole makeup wipe thing anymore. That's the reason why actually my skin is as good as it is because I don't clog up my pores. So or maybe I'm just actually blessed with good genetics of skin. I don't know. Okay, I'm done with my skincare. This is what I look like. Anyway, I want to come in and say a lot of people actually have been asking me about if italki is taking an applicant right now. You know what I did, guys? I don't know exactly when the applications open, but what I read is that um, languages to teach or jobs open up every first of the month or end of the month. So that's what I did when I applied. I just camped on their website. Like, I think on the last day of the month, like maybe the 30th or the 31st of the 
end of the month or the first of the new month that's when i applied i remember i applied on the 30 30th or the 31st of august i'm not sure when august ends but like that's when i applied um officially officially and then my application got accepted i think like towards the end of october or in november that's when i started working so yeah i'm not sure when they actually really open so you just need to check on the website like you can't ask me are they open right now it means that i have to go on the website and actually like check for you which i kind of don't mind doing but like if i have like a lot of people asking me on instagram and a lot of people asking me under like my youtube comments then it's gonna be like too much to just do all that but like the website is www.italki.com you can just check and then when you proceed with your application you can see if the application or the job to teach english is open then you can check that way instead of like asking me but i'll help where i can but i can't like do the work for you you know i've given you as much information as i can i don't know what else to say but yeah i don't know when they open but like i just camped on the website to see when they actually open applications good morning guys welcome back to another day in this vlog so today i'm not taking a day off obviously like i'm gonna start working it is currently 10 a.m i am doing intermittent fasting so i'm gonna start eating at 12 but right now i'm just chilling i just thought i should come and update the vlog <laughs> again because today is not enough day today i'm actually doing my classes and they're gonna start at like 1 p.m 1 30 p.m i have my classes from 1 p.m until 7 p.m today we have load shedding at like 9 but like it doesn't really affect my classes today so i'm very very thankful of that and today is actually my mom's birthday so happy birthday to my mom if she watches my vlog <laughs> she used to i hope she still does happy birthday says Tuli, if you're watching this and yeah i went down memory lane i actually was looking at my old pictures i went to my google photos and i saw my pictures from like six seven years ago you guys uh you guys yo i went through so many phases it's actually so so funny i'll actually insert some of the pictures here so you guys can see i was actually even doing like tiktok before it was even called tiktok it was called musically back then like i was i like things okay i really like things and like it's actually like, i don't know like it made me happy this morning to actually see those pictures i was like oh my god i've come so far like i'm actually but that's besides the point uh it was very very nice for me to actually see those pictures like they made me happy and i was like wow damn i was actually skinny <laughs> i was really really skinny i was in my skinny girl era or whatever but yeah i actually am thinking of studying a scrapbook or like a photo album because we don't have photo albums like all our pictures are backed up on the cloud or something like that i want like a proper traditional photo album like the ones that our parents have i want to actually go buy one and print out some pictures and start one i think that would be fun like i'll go find specific pictures because like i take a million million pictures and actually start a photo album that would actually be such a great idea i want to do that i really want to do that but yeah um see you guys a bit later i'll show you guys the food that i'm going to eat today my ingredients for my salad lettuce cucumber tomato and an apple i'm actually low-key obsessed with pickles right now whatever they call them and no i'm not pregnant but i like the taste which is weird i'm gonna add this too even though technically this is this but pickled <laughs> but yeah these are my ingredients for my salad guys yeah, so here is my salad i am done i have some chicken a bit burnt but whatever some avo and the rest of the salad obviously is down in there so yeah just gonna eat that and carry on with the day i wish you could spend more time with that because i think out of us three i spent the most with him my sister didn't really get to grow up with my dad as much as I did. When my mom moved to Hawaii, she brought me to my dad visited you. Yeah. How exactly did he visit you? My tree. This is so random, but am I the only one that gets pleasure from like refilling the bottle? Also, buying the refill is cheaper than actually rebuying the whole bottle. So I saved this bottle and like just refill um, it. It still looks nice. Keep it nice so yeah i'm about to wash some dishes quickly before my lesson i'm done eating 
and i will see you guys later okay not later but like it's like four dishes because it's just the two of us this is what i love about not living at my parents house anymore i hate to say it but i don't have to wash a lot of dishes anymore because it's not a family of four can you imagine four bowls four cups four plates four spoons four forks four everything but here yeah, it's just two so my boyfriend eats breakfast and i eat breakfast just two bowls and if i wash it in the morning i don't have to wash it you know you know yeah yeah see what i mean four dishes which i'm about to wash quickly <laughs> My toss is starting right now. Uh, hello, hello. Hello, how are you? Hey, with Karma. Oh, okay. I'll give you a minute. Hey, I'm going to connect my format. Oh, okay. Okay, I'll give you a moment. That's okay. okay. This one is like the 20 rand. Can you see? No, he's, he's not the creator of my country, but this is Nelson Mandela. You know you know about Nelson Mandela, yes? Yes, yes. And then this one is the 10 rand. So he's also on this one. Obviously, is like 40 rand. Coins. So this is our 2 rand coin, but this one is an old coin. Guess who's back home? Say hi, dear old. Hi, dear old. Say hi to the vlog, dear old. Hi to the vlog, dear old. Anyway, I'm done with my class now. I are done for now. Having my homemade a burger. Good night. We wanna go somewhere. Bronx stands by the door and he starts shaking. Like he's shivering. Look at him, look at him, look at him, look. <laughs> we are gonna go grocery shopping quickly and I'm gonna take you with. What are you doing? This is literally why we needed to restock the fridge. We only have like an Evo cheese 
and some bacon and it's all empty so gonna stock it up now there we go much better all stocked up for the week my bestie here you go hey you guys so it is dinner time i'm gonna attempt to make thai green curry today i actually bought all the ingredients for it so i'm gonna show you after and i'm also gonna show you like the ingredients before i make it but it's my first time doing it and i'm using like a youtube video like i always do with all my meals <laughs> hopefully it turns out nice and all that stuff so i will show you when i'm done yeah so i'm about to prep it is like past five right now and we eat dinner early so yeah see you guys when i'm done hey you guys welcome back to another day in this vlog adulthood is the real hood okay like my friend he's telling me adulthood is the real hood and you know what for once i actually understand i'm actually running a bit late i need to go run my errands i need to go fix a couple of things i think my bank card not i think i actually know like my bank card is expiring this is the first time my bank card is actually like expired or I've owned a bank card long enough for it to expire you know so i need to get all that fixed i'm dressed a bit formal i'm wearing this blazer and this polo neck and i'm carrying my big girl bag so yeah i need to request an uber quickly because taxis around east london are actually kind of weird like taxis are actually private cars which i don't know like it's a bit sus <laughs> Not that the taxis back home or in Gauteng are better, but like I can't tell if it's a taxi or someone's car. So yeah, so I'm gonna request quickly and then I'll come back because I need to be back by 12 in order for me to do my lessons for the day. So yeah, let me go. Got my key. I don't know what else I need. Actually, I think everything's in my bag. Yeah, um, I'll see you guys when I come back actually. I'm just not like this is gonna be like a very quick thing. I don't think I'll have time to vlog or anything like that. So I'll just vlog when I come back because I have lessons from 12 until 7 p.m. So it's gonna be a very long day today. So yeah, let's go. So guys, I am back from my errands. It's been actually like a very long morning. And I'm trying to film again with the back camera of my phone. Which I don't know how this is gonna turn out, but I hope it turns out good. I'm done. I'm gonna go change out of this outfit and I'm gonna wear just like, you know, a sweatshirt and just be comfortable. Change out of my jeans and boots. I'm actually wearing my pretty boots. <laughs> if that it matters. Um, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna change out of this outfit and wear like a nice chilled outfit and get on with the day. I haven't had breakfast yet because you guys know that I'm doing intermittent fasting. I'm gonna have food at 12 again. And I'm not even sure what I want to have actually. I have Evo and a couple of like greens in the fridge. I should probably make some spinach, an egg, an Evo or something. I don't know. We'll see when I eventually decide to eat what I'm going to eat. But yeah, I'm going to get on with that and then I'm going to prep for my lessons because they're coming up soonish. I think I have like an hour left or so to do all that. And then we're good to go. I'm making some hollandaise sauce for my breakfast. I'm making some eggs benedict. I'll basically show you guys when I'm done. You have it, you guys. This is my eggs benedict. Explain. I follow a recipe on YouTube on how to make everything. So here at the bottom, there's like mushrooms, there's tomato, bacon, evo, the eggs, the hollandaise sauce. And then on this side, I obviously have my pickles because I'm obsessed with pickles right now. I don't know why, but I can't eat a meal without pickles. So yeah, this is my breakfast. It's currently half past 11, so I'm gonna eat quickly before I start my lessons. I'm not eat at 12, but like I have classes back to back to back now. I won't have a chance to eat at 12. So yeah, that's what I'm eating right now. But yeah, I'm changed. I'm done making breakfast. I'm done washing dishes and all that stuff. And yeah, I'm gonna enjoy my meal. See you guys later. There's no way my food is top tier. Top two and not two. It's so delicious. Oh my god. Love it. I am going to cover myself with my blanket and start my class. And like, oh, four minutes, four minutes, four minutes. There's four minutes left. And I'm gonna be ready soon. Yeah. 
Bronx, stop walking around. Stop it. Complete. This is vlog is again another two week vlog because I don't want to make one week vlogs anymore. I don't want to post as often. Bronxy, I'm so sorry. I did you want to play? Flaky, did you want to play with your robe? You can play with your robe, but you need to be quiet. You need to be quiet, ne? Ne? With this lesson, I'm doing it on Google Meet because. I don't know, there's something wrong with the internet connection of my student in their country. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't really watch those type of videos. I only watch, like I said before, I listen to podcasts, you know, like self-improvement podcasts. Not like, you are beautiful, you are resilient. No, 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 I find those ridiculous. I'm like, no, stop, stop it. But like, you know, like just women sharing their own life experiences. I can officially say I'm not done for the day. <laughs> I'm so tired though. I'm why do I still have these earphones on? I'm so tired. I'm really really tired. My next class is at two. It's so crazy how you actually low-key become friends with the people that you teach on italki. I don't know how to explain it. Like, because some of the students that I have here, I see them like on a daily basis. So or on a three days out of the week type basis so i hear about their weekend i hear about their work life work problems and all that stuff so i don't know it's very nice like it's very very nice i will say it actually reduces some of the loneliness that you might have in life so yeah look at the fluffs look at my dog guys they at the back he's just chilling and i put that blanket there for him so he can sit on it because he loves sitting on the couch we are done for now again the world is back even. He has graced us with his appearance. Okay, so you are forcing me to eat vegan. I'm forcing you to eat vegan. And to make vegan, but then you have eggs benedict and everything. <laughs> Wait, why are you saying this to my vlog? Now no, people fuck you. That's not right. Look, <laughs> well, I'm not sick with your veganism. Do you want me to make you eggs benedict? Yes. No, I'm actually not going through. Yo, you know how much work it was. Exactly. The hassle I had to go through. You guys, the kitchen looked insane. Uh, cause I don't want to eat that again. I'll make food. It's fine since you don't want to cook. You see, do you see who cooks every day? Me. I cook. He doesn't want to cook. Welcome back to another day in this vlog. Made the same food as yesterday's breakfast again. Yeah. See you guys when I do my lesson. Hey guys, welcome back to another day in this vlog. Today's probably one of those days where it actually sucks to do online teaching because I genuinely don't want to do it. Like, I really, really don't want to do it, but I have to do it because this bag is not going to get itself. So, I have a lesson starting right now. And... I'm not in the mood for it it happens sometimes i am not interested in doing my lessons and i actually don't want to do it but i force myself to do it because i need to so yeah i won't show you guys this lesson because i probably have to be semi-fake and smile along because i don't want my student not to come back but i feel like so yeah see you guys when i am done so i am done with my lesson i feel a bit better than how i started because you know teaching when i talk or teaching online in general like you get to meet a lot of people you actually kind of become friends with these people and you guys are in each other's lives low-key <laughs> in a way so yeah i feel better like the lady that i taught now she's such a joy to talk to actually like I low-key love her a lot <laughs> she's just my favorite um, but I just wanted to come on here and say that not all my days are happy chappy days like I think I feel like more often than I'd like to admit because I just don't like vlog it I always say like every time I feel like it, I don't vlog it because I don't want to bring like negative energy to the internet um, and I don't want to be like a Debbie Downer but I feel like sometimes like it's natural and it's like natural procreation and it's actually part of real life for you to like not feel your best especially when you have to like do work 
I don't know. I don't want to sound like I'm ungrateful. You know, sometimes when you wanted to do something and you actually get to do that thing and then now you're like kind of complaining about what you're doing. I don't want to be one of those people, you know, but sometimes it kind of sucks. Like it really, really sucks. Like I feel like I just don't want to do this sometimes, you know, I'm just like, oh, I just want to chill. I just want to watch TV. I just want to like lazy around or whatever but then at the same time i feel bad because if i don't work then i don't make money and i'm always going to be like oh my god i don't have money for this i don't have money for that uh, you know so i'm just not ugh, i feel like shit like i've even asked my boyfriend like, oh so what do you do like you don't feel like going to work today or oh, you don't feel like this is like no i just suck it up and i like, just do it and that doesn't sound nice to me like that doesn't sound okay like why do we just have to suck it up and just like do it you know but i guess like it is part of being an adult and growing up and all that stuff i'm sure like other people experience the same feelings and they get through it somehow i'm sure i will get through it somehow too like i don't know i don't know i don't know but like it kind of sucks like it really really sucks to feel like you don't want to do something that you wanted to do so badly that has actually helped you so much to actually achieve some of the things that you wanted to achieve and then now it sounds like you're being ungrateful i don't know maybe i'm a bit burnt out from teaching online and also like i need a change in environment that's why I, like every now and then i'll take like a day off during the week which is a bit abnormal for your normal nine to five working people because they can't just do that unless if, like they take like a six day or unpaid leave or whatever so yeah i don't know i kind of feel like my feelings are not valid but at the same time i know they are valid but like i feel like shit for having those feelings while other people are trying to like sign up on italki and actually teach on italki and i actually have a job on italki to teach and i kind of don't want to do it at this very moment not that i feel like this all the time but i'm just saying like specifically right now i kind of feel like burnt out like so like i said earlier on tomorrow i'm gonna get dressed and like Go to the mall like do my errands and like buy myself something nice because shopping makes me feel good <laughs> um or whatever so i'm gonna take a half day so i already closed off my schedule like this morning when i woke up i already knew like i don't feel my best so i'm gonna close off my schedule and i'm actually gonna go to the mall tomorrow and figure out my life and like figure out all those things that i'm going through and like actually like take myself out and just enjoy being out just like by myself and like have a change of environment i feel like that's one thing that people don't talk about especially like with remote jobs and jobs that you have to do at home because you're always home like you're literally always home and i work from monday to saturday so i'm always home and i only have like sundays off and that's the day like you know i'll go to the beach with my dogs or do this and this and this so i'm working this saturday too so Tomorrow I'm working to I'm working this whole week basically, but I'm gonna make myself unavailable until 2 p.m. And I already know that I already like have pre-book classes at 2 p.m. that I'm gonna come back and have to do, but I'm going out tomorrow. I'm gonna leave the house. I have I need something different, basically. So yeah, it's not great to feel like shit, but we're here. Tell me why I thought using Uber was actually cheap. Meanwhile, this whole time, all four of my trips, I've actually just been discounted. And then now, the Uber is expensive. And I had planned, I think I told you guys that I had planned that I'm going to go out today and actually go to the mall and do all these things and stuff. Where? <laughs> Where? Because I am not paying 100 Rand to go to a place which is like seven minutes away from me. When I could walk no ways no ways i refuse but anyway uh i just came in to tell you guys that i changed my plans i got ready and i look I look nice if i do say so myself um but i'm not going anywhere anymore it's fine i'll just sit here and be miserable because i'm not gonna pay that much money i also wanted to eat something i wanted to like go buy something i have been paying 14 rand and 15 rand at most no 19 rand at most to travel using uber but this whole time, they're actually giving me a discount. So low-key, I was paying 52 Rand, but I was getting like almost like 50% discount. So I was only paying like not even half of the price, less than half of the price. So now they want me to pay all that money? No. 
I don't think so. Sorry. Nope. So I'm staying home. I have my lesson starting at 2. So I'll just do that. I don't know when I'll go out because today is Thursday. I need to start editing this vlog soon. So, well. I am doing my lesson. It is 2 p.m. And I'm actually <laughs> one minute late. Because <laughs> I was busy watching YouTube videos. I went down the rabbit hole today of watching a lot of YouTube videos, so oopsie. I am gonna do this lesson and then I don't know what I'm making for dinner tonight actually. Which is something that I'm a tit bit worried about. But we shall figure it out. Yeah, I changed out of my clothes because I wasn't going anywhere anymore. No more mall for me. I can't believe I'm spending the whole week at home. Yeah, see you guys after the lesson and I maybe will I'll put you here so you can listen in a bit maybe we'll see hello hello, hello. Yeah, yeah. hi how, how are, are you? you I'm fine what about you I'm great how yeah, has yeah. your day been uh, uh, just two days? Yeah. Just two days? Yes, yes, yes. Just two days. Uh, okay. Uh, yesterday I went to, uh, after my uh, work, I went to uh, went to, um, um, went to a uh, China cluster, uh, the international city. Oh. Uh, the international city and uh, yeah, yeah, that's a uh, China cluster. Uh, yeah. But it's far away from my uh, area. Morning, you guys today is the last day of this vlog and I woke up craving porridge so I'm gonna make myself some porridge and I'm gonna start editing this vlog so this is basically me coming on here to just say thank you guys for watching and please don't forget to subscribe please don't forget to like and I also see that the channel is growing I didn't think like I'd still get more subscribers but I am so thank you guys so 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 much for still subscribing to my channel and still watching my videos and all of that nice stuff and i think we are about to hit 1.5 subscribers which is insane i think i gained like 300 if not 400 subscribers within the last two months so that's amazing i never even like actually celebrated or said anything about it because you know i'm just like ugh, not really counting subscribers anymore but it's actually kind of crazy and we're kind of close to getting monetized too so yeah thank you guys so much for subscribing thank you guys so much for your content support thank you guys for always watching my videos and liking and commenting i see it whenever i get a comment you guys appreciate it so thank you guys so 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 much and yeah i will see you